Hello and welcome to the Life Detox course. I'm Jo Bailey, clinical psychologist, energy medicine practitioner and your facilitator throughout the next few modules. Firstly, this is just a welcome video. Thank you. Thank you for taking the time to sit here and listen to this content. Thank you for trusting me and getting on board and having a look at what Life Detox is all about. This video is just an introductory video, a welcome video, and to let you know what you're going to expect over the next few modules and what we can achieve in the way of emotional freedom, not just for now, but enduring lifelong emotional freedom, something that's going to stay with you for the rest of your life. No more therapy for years on end, no more doctors, no more medicines, because this is essentially about how you can heal yourself and the body it is designed to heal itself. So this is a bit of mind over medicine. Now, having said that, I want you to know that everything that I do in this course is scientific. It is science-based. There is nothing here that is esoteric and weird and right out there on the fringe. Even though I am into some of that stuff, you'll find that in the Soul Detox course. So that's another course that's going to go deeper into the spiritual aspect of what we will touch on in this course. So let's talk about some of the things that we're going to cover, some of the things that you can expect from this course. And starting with the placebo effect, you're going to hear me talk about this a lot because, wow, this is one of the strongest drugs on the planet. The proof uh, of the placebo effect is that the mind can cure the body. Now, this is evidence-based. We know this is true. How you think, so you will be. If you are full of negative thoughts, if you are full of self-limiting, uh, defeating thoughts, and you think that you can't do something, well, guaranteed right there is your problem. That kind of thought is going to be an obstacle and something we're going to talk about in this course as well. I don't know if you've heard of the Spontaneous Remission Project. This was a project conducted by the Institute of Noetic Science where they looked at three and a half thousand cases in the, the scientific medical literature where patients would recover from illnesses that were otherwise incurable and diseases and illnesses that in many cases were terminal and should have, according to all the medical information, resulted in death. These are cases where people got better. Uh, so we're going to have a look at the Spontaneous Remission Project and we're going to have a look at why that works. When we talk about these kind of illnesses, these things where people recovered from, I'll tell you what we're talking about, just so you've got an idea of how powerful this is. We are talking not just about radically changing their diets, but they did do that in many instances. We're talking about people that took control of their health, we are talking about um, following your intuition and there's a large part of that in this course, knowing that you are the expert in your body, nobody else. What will happen is you'll go to one professional, they'll tell you something, you'll go to another professional, they'll tell you something else. You've got to trust your body, your body knows. It has the innate intuitive wisdom, but you are putting your faith in other modalities, other so-called experts. I'm not the expert in your life, you are the expert in your life. I'm gonna show you how to tap into that and know when your body is trying to talk talk to you. We're going to look at using herbs and supplements, nature's own uh, pharmacy, right? Everything that we need is already there in abundance, freely available to us in nature. Releasing suppressed emotions, huge one. Uh, building up things like resentment, frustration, anger, guilt, shame. All these kind of emotions have an impact on the physical body. And again, this is all based in science and I will, will tell you more about that and how increasing the positive emotions. And by positive, I'm not talking about just joyful, happiness, bliss. No one comes to me and says, you know, Joe, I want to be blissfully happy every day for the rest of my life. People come to me because they're stuck in the old habits and the pain and the hurt. So by positive emotions, I'm talking about reaching a new level of appreciation, of gratitude, that kind of joy, contentment. That's what most people want, they want peace. Embracing the right kind of social support. So maybe distancing from some of the people that are contributing to the negative state that you're in and embracing uh, a new group of people around you. Uh, and that can be the nurturing care of a health professional, um, but sometimes the doctor is the placebo and we'll talk about that too. Uh, deepening spiritual connection. So a spiritual connection means different things to different people, but we all need one. The other thing, the other reported reason why people said that they believed they got better and recovered from these uh, apparent incurable diseases was a strong belief. 
a conviction, uh, a purpose for living. Uh, and I talk about these three P's, passion, purpose, and pleasure. We need these in our life. These, these are perhaps some of the strongest elixirs you will find. So yes, people got better. They got better from HIV. They got better from stage four cancers, from diabetes one, from heart disease. All these things uh, in the literature, the Spontaneous Remission Project, were healed. They, they went away, spontaneous remission. So we know it can happen. We know it's possible. And tapping into those possibilities and believing they're possible is really what the placebo effect is all about, that conviction of belief. Hugely important and a massive part of the Life Detox course. And remember, there's the other sister of um, placebo, the nocebo effect. But you will hear about that too. That's where the negative outcomes occur due to a belief that the intervention or the advice or the medicine or the therapy or whatever it is, is not doing you any benefit. It's causing you harm. If you believe it, so it will be. So I'm going to show you that your body has these innate healing processes already built in. And there's this innate connection to nature that strengthens and amplifies the healing process. Hemostasis, that's where your blood clots so that you don't bleed to death. You don't have to think about that. Your body just does it. Your blood pressure is regulated, your heart rhythms and heart rate, yeah, all these things are done in the background. The inflammatory response, the proliferation, maturation, remodeling process. The mind is powerful and it's connected to the body. It's a bilateral process. So what you put into your mind will impact your body. How you treat your body will also impact your mind. So we want to strengthen these connections by making sure that we're giving both the body and mind the best elixirs possible. So the body's working with balance all the time and there will be a whole module on balancing the body. Now, balance is something that is integral to all life and ecosystems. There is this delicate balance, this fragility amongst all creation. And we are often out of balance. Uh, energy systems are part of that balance. Remember, this is an introductory video and I get carried away because I get excited by this, but this is all the content that I'm going to introduce you to. But the mind also needs balance. Our, our mind, if it's out of balance, so will our emotional states and so will our physical well-being. It will be all out of balance. So we need to regain that balance and that sense of control. Sometimes part of that balance is just giving your body and mind a break. We work so hard. We're under constant stress and pressure. I've got some stats here. Listen to this. People that take no vacation are a third more likely to get heart disease. People that report feeling happier and more content, so that's that piece that I said most people are after, live seven to 10 years longer than the stressed out ones. Even attending church results in an increase in longevity up to 14 years. I don't go to church, but this is the data. We know that by being in that sort of community, it increases your lifespan. People that are reported to be optimists on psychological scales are up to 70% less likely to get heart disease than people that are pessimists. So that stress response, it is a huge factor. It's a critical factor in what we are going to be talking about. So if you're carrying around a lot of stress, you better be ready to let it go because stress has no part in a life detox course. But I'm not just gonna tell you to let go of stress. I'm gonna show you how to do it. Norepinephrine, adrenaline, cortisol, these are our stress chemicals. These are the chemicals that are meant to be really short-lived. They're meant to like flood your body if you are under immediate threat or danger. If a big bear comes into my room right now, I need these chemicals to surge through my body so that I can react quickly. I don't wanna stop and think and ponder. I need to just react. So the blood flow has to go to my extremities, to my legs, to my hands, ready to fight or flee. But then after the threat has gone, I need to be able to settle again. It's, if you think of the gazelle in the savannah, you know, once the lion comes, they need a big rush of adrenaline so that they can run and escape the threat. But you know what happens? Once the lion goes, you don't see the gazelle cowering behind a tree, looking anxiously, waiting for the next lion. No, the gazelle goes back to the grass and starts grazing again. But we stay in these chronic stress responses that are causing us so much harm. We suffer from all these chronic conditions, autoimmune conditions, uh, irritable bowel syndrome, fibromyalgia, diabetes, heart disease, rheumatoid arthritis. There's just so many different illnesses, multiple sclerosis, all these things we know in the medical literature are amplified when the person is under stress. There is a, a real 
tight association with chronic illness and stress. The parasympathetic system, this is part of our nervous system, is meant to restore balance. And too many of us have things called adrenal fatigue, where our adrenal glands, a little uh, thumbnail size gland that sits above your kidney that produces the, the stress chemicals, is working overtime, all the time, so much so that it just becomes exhausted, it burns out. Uh, and then we get things like stubborn belly fat and a bunch of other conditions that are related to adrenal fatigue. So we need to reboot the adrenal gland. We need a hit of some of the good chemicals, uh, oxytocin, nitric oxide, which is related to vasodilation. We need some serotonin, dopamine, like these are the chemicals that our body also produces that are synthetically copied in things like antidepressants. So antidepressants are usually a way of trying to increase the serotonin in your body because serotonin is a feel good chemical. In any case, we can get all these things through our food, through our diet, and through the way we think. So that's what I'm gonna show you in the Life Detox course, how we shift that balance from a state of unwellness, dis-ease, to one of ease, contentment, peace, and self-healing. So I want you to get excited because what we're gonna do over the next few modules is change your life. But you've gotta be ready and you've gotta be willing. And that's why sometimes I choose to hand select the people that come into these courses. Um, but then I feel like that's a bit discriminatory. I want everyone to benefit. But I want you also to know that I wanna build a community through this. So I'm gonna put some spaces out there for us to be able to talk to each other. Because like I said, the people that go to church, this is gonna be our church. There's a healing that occurs, a longevity, an increase in your lifespan by surrounding in yourself with people of the same kind of belief systems. So welcome again. Uh, that was a long introduction, I know, but let's get into the modules. So you've got all the modules here set out for you. I will see you in every single module and at the end, and I wish you well, I wish you peace, but most of all, I wish you health and happiness and longevity. See you soon.